Come on, come on to the Minecraft found Jimmy Swift's skills will drive you wild From a treehouse to a city bank It's the Minecraft Files all day Alright, that was a good one. I like that one a lot. Hey, what's going on, Switches? It's Chimmy Saphir, and welcome back to the Minecraft Files. This is episode 19 in season 3, and today's user request comes from Wiley J, I think. That's how you pronounce it. Um, and they want me to build a hot tub by the fireplace. Now, where I'm at right now is a little ways away from the Minecraft world that um, you guys are used to seeing, and I will get there in a minute. But I'm just going to give you a quick sneak peek of what's coming up. Um, at a um, sort of recent episode of the Minecraft Files, uh, somewhere in the near future. Um, and I'm in my little sort of mining outpost down here. Um, and uh, basically this is all I'm going to let you guys see for right now. Uh, that video will be coming out hopefully sometime soon. It's just sort of an informative video. What we're going to do today is I'm going to go back to the back up to the surface. And it looks like it is nighttime. Dang, dang, dang. Oh, wait, shoot. I forgot to do something. I wanted to, uh, I wanted to cook up some iron and leave that in here while I was, uh, while I'm away. So let me do that. Leave that cooking. All right, perfect. Okay, so we're going to head back to, uh, to the village, and I'm going to show you guys sort of how to get there from here. And of course, as you guys know, um, I will let you download this world upon the season finale, or probably eh, probably sooner. I'm hoping that this season goes for a long time. Obviously, season one was 100 episodes. Uh, season, uh, hey guys, what's up? Season two got cut short at 15, just because 1.8 sort of um, sort of surprised me and came quicker than I had thought. Um, but I want season three hopefully to last for a while. So hopefully, uh, when Minecraft gets released at Minecon, which I will be at, I'm very excited. Um, it won't um, it won't change too drastically. Oh gosh, there you go. It won't change too drastically such that this world won't be different. It should be should be the same. So uh, it should still work. So we're gonna have to make a a, a night run here. Ow! Yikes! Get out of here. Hey. Oh, sun is rising. Ah, get me to safety. Get me to safety. No, 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 no. Ooh. Okay, go up to the mountain. Into the pathway. Okay, now this is cool. Check this out. So, uh, you guys can see where I came from out there. So I came up the hill. Oh, I hear something crawling up there. Um, okay. So now let's head back. You guys are gonna burn in about a minute and a half. So I'm gonna run right by you. If I was running 1.9 pre-release um, four, I would kill you and give you, and so that I could level up and uh, and get those leveling up points for the enchanting. But um, yeah, probably not gonna happen. So now every time I get to my village, now it seems that with this. I don't know if it's a texture pack or just Minecraft seems to be lagging. So I'm going to go ahead and switch my video settings because you guys have been apparently really frustrated, which is cool, um, to to these settings here. So we're going to do fast graphics and short distance. My computer can handle this far stuff. I don't know what's going on. Uh, I don't know if I've got some sort of a process running in the background that all of a sudden popped up. Um, but anyways, we're back in the village. And uh, I'm going to go set up the barbecue uh, because we're going to make a hot tub. So let me uh, let me start that, and uh, I'll need. Let's see. I'm gonna need the supplies. Um, not sure what I'm gonna what I'm gonna need. One second. All right. Uh, all right. Let me see here. I think we're gonna need some water. So let me let me go back to the house here. I'm gonna get some water buckets. And um, guys, just so you know, uh, I am hoping to post a fair amount of videos today. I'm not sure how many I'll get out. Um, my mom is having knee surgery today, and I kind of have to take care of her. So um, if you guys could um, could leave her some, some warm wishes in the comments, um, that would be amazing. And uh, I will pass them along to her. But uh, yep, she's got to have knee surgery, so i got to kind of take care of her today. So today may not be the best day to upload stuff, but I will probably be recording and um, 
and things of that nature. So we should be good. We should be good. All right. So one thing that I wanted to do with this hot tub versus the one I did in season one was I actually wanted to get lava. And once we set everything up, I'm going to go ahead and, um, and sort of heat the pool up with lava instead of, um, uh, what you call it instead of a fire because you guys seem to think that fire was a bad was a bad thing to do or a bad thing to use with with a hot tub I don't see a problem in it honestly um, but if you guys wanted me to change it I can change it for you so I'm gonna go ahead and clear some of this out and uh, nobody will ever be able to make a hot tub as cool as Paul Sears Jr who of course made one in his epic series, uh, How to Survive and Thrive in Minecraft. Um, and I watched those tutorials way back in the day. But uh, we'll see if we can sort of make something kind of cool. Um, because I like making hot tubs. Hot tubs are fun. And it sort of goes along with this theme I seem to be going with uh, in this world. It's kind of a, uh, a relaxed, like, not like a party theme, but it's kind of it's kind of like that because I'll keep making all these like barbecues and and sort of hangout spots. Oh, and by the way, I have not finished. I'm not done decorating the. Um, I'm not done decorating the inside of my house. I have some really cool ideas actually now of what I want to do for the inside of that house. Um, and I uh, I will show you guys those at a later date. I wanted to get outside and start building some more. And there's no good way up here, and I don't want to destroy the terrain. So I'm going to go out here because I need to get up to the top a little bit. Um, there we go. I, I wanted to take a break a little bit just from uh, all the interior stuff and move outside and build some stuff outside for you guys as well. So um, that's why I'm doing this. And uh, I need to get some health. All right. So let's go ahead and we're going to make uh, a waterfall. Uh, so let's, let's put this there and see where that flows. Where is that going? That is going everywhere I don't want it to go. <laughs> All right. Let's remove that. Take that out. And now we'll do this. Put that there. And see where that flows. Actually, wait. I should probably wait to the other for the other water to, to quit flowing. Because that just spread like wildfire all over the place. All right. Come on, water. There you go. Taking forever, man. It's so, like, <laughs> so funny. All right. That should have the flow pattern that I want. Although, this sort of spreads too far out to the side. So let me, let me, let me revamp this a little bit. Make, maybe make it flow a little more. Uh, straight down. Like that. There we go. All right, that'll take an easy edit down here to fix um, because it is flowing outside um, of this and it's going kind of into the. Um... Well, you know what? Maybe I did mess up because I wanted to sort of come down this way. Maybe I got to go one o one more over. Uh, but I do want it to sort of fill up the hot tub. So let me uh, let me <laughs> re-edit this. And of course, if you guys want to check out the texture pack I'm using, just check the link in the description below. Um, honestly, I am so in love with this texture pack. Uh, don't ask me why. I think um, I think I've been getting really really nostalgic lately about the old Minecraft, just because the new release is coming out, and I kind of want to just remember like how I started and my old roots and. If you guys find that annoying or whatever, like, I'm sorry, but it's, uh, I don't know, it's kind of who I am. I'm a very nostalgic person sometimes, and um, I wanted to kind of uh, remember the old days a little bit while still playing the new version so I can do some new stuff, because I love, I love 1.8. So, um, all right, let's use, here, let's do this, and we'll put the water coming right out of there. Let's see where that flows. Yes. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Uh, not quite. Close, though. 
Um, we are going to need probably something like that to spread it out. Here we go. And maybe... Ah, maybe we need one more. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay, this is almost good. I want it to get all the way out to... Um, out to here. Maybe I can get another bucket of water to do that with. Alright, so let me... Head over here. Uh, do I have an infinite spring anywhere? I can't remember. I should. But I don't know if I do. I think I just have this... Um, this little bay right here. You know, that's probably all I'm going to need. But Yeah, it's pretty much infinite. <laughs> I think somebody left a comment on one of my recent videos saying, why don't I update to 1.9 and, uh, and use potions and stuff? And the reason for that is um, I, I don't see 1.9 as a full stable release. Um, I see 1.8 as a full stable release for right now. Or 1.8.1, I'm sorry. Uh, so that's why I'm, I'm, doing, uh, I'm using 1.8.1. So um, once Minecraft is released and is no longer a beta, um, be it at Minecon, then you will see me fully upgrade. Now, I do play 1.9 pre-release 4 from time to time. I just swap out jars uh, for different videos and things like that, should I ever need them. But uh, for right now, for the purpose of this series, I am just using 1.8.1 because I feel like it's the most stable release that is that is out currently, and uh, I just kind of wanted to, you know, um, to use a, a stable version of the game. So that's that's my reasoning behind it all, um, but yeah. All right, so let's do this again. I do that, and check that out. That's perfect. All right, so we've got a nice little waterfall here. Now we just need to contain it. I don't know what's going on up here. This was a misplaced block. There's no water flowage right there. But if we put water there, that's it. There we go. There we go. Now it's got completely, completely covered and flowed out. Okay. So now what we need to do is we need to make the hot tub itself. And what I'm going to do first is actually block off the water so I can work. So let's block this off like that. And uh, we're going to go ahead and make our hot tub. Um, where do we want to do this? We could do it like right out here. Yeah, why not? Let's do it like right here. Right next to the walkway. It is not off the beaten path at all. It's gonna be right here. All right, cool. So now we've got, uh, we gotta replace some of this with cobblestone. So let's put the cobblestone in. And um, let me see here there I guess this is gonna butt up right next to the uh, actually do I like that I don't like that I want to have a gap so I'm gonna put some dirt back right here is it getting dark no dang it there we go there's the gap Okay, so it's getting nighttime. I'm gonna go ahead and run over here and sleep. All right, let's get in here, sleep the night away. Ah. But uh, but yeah, you guys, make sure you're staying tuned to the channel. Uh, the next like like really heavily the next month or so uh, I'm gonna be doing a lot of different games um, I've already I think I bought like four games in the last like couple days so uh, 
I'm going to be covering those. Obviously, Skyrim is going to be the big one of November, um, right before Minecon. And um, I'm also doing Sonic Generations, which is going to be sweet. Uh, that's coming out November um, 4th. So stay tuned for that as well. I don't know if I'll do a full playthrough of either of those games. Um, mostly, I like to just show you guys gameplay. But who knows? I might really get hooked on uh, Sonic and, and try and get the full thing done um, for you guys. So, so yeah, just stay tuned for that, and um, I will let you know. Okay, so what we need to do now is actually... Um, I am going to go ahead. I'm just trying to think here. I'm going to make an, an infant spring right here. And we're going to go run out to the mine real fast and gather some lava because I need lava for um, for this hot tub. And I didn't bring any. I should have prepared while I was out there. But uh, this little mine is going to be an expansion sort of of our village because uh, I'm going to try and use this mine for some things, uh, for resources. I might do some exploring in it. And it's huge. It is huge. There's an abandoned mine in there and everything. Um, so we might do a few episodes uh, in there as well, but uh, I'm off to explore a little bit here, and this will probably be a longer episode for you guys, which is which is always good, always fun. I know you guys like these longer ones and stuff, so um, I'm gonna get my sword out just in case I meet anything mean and angry along the way. The terrain over here is pretty cool, and I love how like the path, because like I okay last night or two nights ago, I'm sorry, two nights ago. I was downloading Battlefield 3, and the download took forever, so I decided to start playing some Minecraft, which, honestly, you guys might think I play a lot of Minecraft, but I really don't, and it's sad, because I record all the time, and as a commentator, I'm I'm always recording, I'm always recording, I'm always recording, and I don't ever just get to sit and play, and um, so last night, I didn't want to record anything, and I was just playing, and uh, while Battlefield 3 was downloading, and um, so, so I sort of had something else going on in the background, obviously, which is why I didn't really want to run my recording software and I was playing 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 and sort of came across this mine from another mine that's closer to my village and sort of traveled all this way underground and sort of settled here in this little uh, this little mining outpost um, and uh, I don't know basically just um, right, let's take this lava here Uh, basically just played for like four hours and it was amazing I think I was tweeting about it uh, if you guys are following me on Twitter you know like some of the things I may have found um, while I was playing because I was trying to keep you guys in the loop I'm, I'm fun like that trying to keep you guys uh, engaged even if I'm not recording but um, but yeah so I was uh, I was playing and and I just had a great time like playing again it was the first time I was playing and I think a long time so um, I did set up a sort of mining operation down there, and um, we'll probably be doing some stuff with that. But it was a much needed, uh, a much needed endeavor because I got some materials that I um, will show you guys later that are going to help for the series and just help 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 me build and stuff overall. So you guys might know what they are. They start with the letter D. I found a few of them. <laughs> Yes, I found some diamonds. So um, that was good. And uh, obviously in the Minecraft files, being that it's mostly a building series, um, I don't really get to find diamonds that much. So everybody loves diamonds, though. Everybody loves diamonds in Minecraft. You get that rush when you find the diamonds, you know? You're like, oh, yes, I found diamonds. At least that's my reaction to it, usually. <laughs> All right, so we've got the lava. That was uh, quest quest one complete right there. Um We've got the lava for the hot tub. I'm going to go ahead and put that in now when I get back. And uh, and then we'll build up sort of the sides and then fill it fill in the bottom with glass. And then we'll let the water just sort of flow in over that. Um, which from right here looks like it's pretty much ready to go. We're prepped and ready to go. Um, and let me know, do you guys kind of like this little little pathway to the mine there? It's kind of cool. I don't know, I kind of liked it, whatever. Anyways... All right, so here we go. We've got, um, actually, let's back this up. Let's back this up. Let's make it more of a square than a rectangle. There we 
we go. All right, so trying to think. We want to make it one one block deep of water. So I'm gonna go ahead and put uh, the lava in. Hopefully, I have enough. All right, let's go ahead and do this. We're gonna go ahead and put the lava in now, like that. Uh, and I'm going to put it in the first in the four corners, and we're gonna see how it spreads out. Uh, let's put this in over here. I do not want to die. There we go. I may not have enough for it to be completely balanced, but uh, we'll see. I'm creeping, creeping, creeping. Let me get rid of this. There you go. Um, I can live with that. That looks fine, except for I should have replaced the walls. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> Rookie mistake. Okay, I'm not a I'm not a hot tub expert, lava expert. I'm not a hot tub expert. So what I'm gonna do is uh, we're gonna collect this lava again. I forgot to wall it off or wall put the walls in, which is not good. Totally, totally forgot. And um, let's jump down there. And now we gotta fill it in. For some weird reason, lava has this property where it will still flow and and be lava even if it doesn't have a source block there, which is really interesting to me. Um, because water is not that way. If water is only flows if there's a source block, lava still flows if it's been poured and it's sort of spread out for a while. And then even if it doesn't have a source block, it'll like it'll keep flowing, which I'm like, that doesn't make sense. I don't know, maybe it's got some sort of like extraterrestrial like properties or something crazy like that. Who knows? Alrighty. So let's get uh, let's get this replaced. And I'm gonna leave the floor dirt because it's a hot tub and it's gonna be covered in lava. So you're not gonna be able to see that. And it's not gonna matter. But the rest of this stuff I wanna make. Oh, misplaced block. I wanna make cobblestone. There we go. Alright, so let's get ourselves out of here. And I'm gonna go ahead and pour the first bit in. The second bit. Let's get rid of that. And that. And then we're gonna do these two guys. Like this, and this. There we go. All right, so now we need the glass, and I've got 15 pieces of glass. Hoping that's enough. And we're going to fill it in like this. Should be enough. Uh-oh. We're one short. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's so stupid. Dang it. <laughs> no. All right, let me see if I have any more back here. And I really do need to get this house organized. Um, all right, I've got glass panes. I have sand. Why don't I just cook one block up? Why not? Let's leave that there. Do I have any down here? I don't think I do. No, I've got a ton of fences. Somebody pointed that out in the comments. I compl I've completely been forgetting that I have all of those fences. It's like, ugh. And no glass. And more fences. Wow. Let's move those over. Yeah, that's bad. I completely forgot. And look at this. I found some... I found some even more saddles in uh, in a dungeon, a couple dungeons that I found while I was mining last night. Oh, I need the glass. I almost ran away. There we go. Um, so I've got even more saddles now. We're going to have to be doing some pig rides. and I think when the final game gets released, who knows? They might add more achievements, but one of those achievements obviously is 
Uh, this one, when pigs fly. I don't have this achievement. Oh man, I gotta work on some stuff. But uh, yeah, I did get that at the end of season two. That was the season two finale. I figured out a way to to make the pigs fly, so to speak. And um, yeah, so anyways. All right, here we go. Now the water is gonna be flowing from this little uh, little catch basin sort of into the into the hot tub. And now what we're gonna do, though, to even out the currents, is take some of this water and we're gonna place it around inside like this. And I don't know if I'm gonna actually be able to manipulate the currents such that it's still. Oh, you know what I think I have to do? I think I have to, um, I think I've got to uh, actually fill the pool up before I... Oh no, 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 no. No, it's flowing everywhere. Oh no! Okay, now I've really done it. Now I've really messed up. Dang it. Are you kidding me right now? completely messed up the currents flowing flowing downwards and you guys are probably like what are you doing well I'm trying to stop the flow of this freaking water now where is this still flowing in from oh right here okay wow took all that to stop that stupid current okay so what I'm <laughs> what I'm gonna do is uh Put the water in the corners first. And then when the water flows in, once I get this, the current sort of balanced out like this, it'll just be even. There we go. And I think we've got to do that from this side also. Maybe? I don't know, it's hard to see those currents underwater. It's, oh, there we go. There. See, now it's completely still. Water is completely still. Of course, we've got the moving lava underneath, but the water is completely still. And now, if I come up here and uh, remove these, this freaking tower. There we go. There we go. Now the only problem I see is um, how it jets out like this. So we're gonna have to uh, actually build out um, like this. Let's go out this way and sort of just cut off the water. So to sort of cut it off like that. And that should then, once we can keep doing this sort of downwards until we've sort of given it a normal flow pattern again. Um, Oops, there we go. Now, when I remove these blocks, it should look more natural um, flowing. Because what happened was I placed a block sort of inside the current, and the current sort of went over that block, and then um, so that's when I just sort of disrupted everything, and uh, I had to fix that. So that's basically what I just did there. You guys may already know what I'm talking about. Maybe you don't. If you do, awesome. All right, so there we go. We've got our little hot tub. And um, I'm trying to think of, uh, of what else we could add for this. I mean, it's pretty basic. Um, I do want to add a. Here, let me let me do this. Get this out of there, and then we'll replace it with these guys. Um, I do want to make a jukebox. So I need to go get a diamond. I should have, I think, 18 of them. I got a bunch. We're gonna make a, um... yep, here we go. We're gonna make a jukebox. 
And I don't have a record yet. I need to get one. I think I'm going to try and do... Uh, I might do an episode of the Minecraft Files, actually, where I do, where I have a, uh, oh, wait, I just made a chest. Wow, I'm an idiot. It's so, mm, I'm recording this the night before, actually, and it's it's late. Uh, there we go, jukebox, okay. Um, yeah, I'm recording this the night before, and uh, I know I just did the video called Sweet Creeper Music, where I tried to get a skeleton to shoot and kill a creeper, but I actually might do that in an episode of the Minecraft Files, because we need to get a record, so we can play some tunes, and I want to put a jukebox also uh, inside over here too. I'm not done decorating this area. So uh, that's kind of a key. And I may actually need some more bricks because I'd like to keep this brick theme over here um, of this fireplace and sort of use that in, incorporate that with the hot tub. Uh, whether I make sort of like a, I don't know, like a backstop, like a backdrop back here and sort of enclose the hot tub in. I'm not sure. I'll probably do some off camera work, but uh, we'll see. But for right now, um, for right now, let's put the, the jukebox right there. And um, I'm trying to think. I don't, I don't know if this was the best location. But it works. It works out. And uh, yeah, I don't know. Let's put some torches right here in the corners at least. Obviously, that one's got the, um, the jukebox on it. But, uh, yeah, I'll, I'm going to end this here. I'll go get some clay and stuff, like, off camera. And uh, we can maybe maybe spice this up a little bit better. Um, and something else that could be could be of use to us would be, like, maybe a tree. You could put, like, a sort of for shade underneath the, or around the hot tub. So let me go grab a, a sapling real fast. And some bone meal. And we'll grow that and see what that looks like. If not, I can just take it down. It's not a big deal. All right, so we've got... Uh, the, the sapling there. I'm gonna grab. Oops. Let me get some bone meal and run off to do this, and then we'll end the episode. So this one's been a bit, little bit longer for you guys, and um, here we go. Let's do some right here. There we go. That is a low tree. That is a low tree. I don't like how low that is. Let's see if we can get a higher one. Come on, I need another sapling though. Hello. There we go. Ah, oh, two. Perfect. Alright, there we go. Alright. Taller tree. Yeah, there we go. That looks good. It looks even better. Alright, so a little bit of decoration. Let's do, uh, fancy. There, that looks good. So now that, um, tree is looking a little bit better. And, uh, it's sort of overshadowing our little hot tub here. Which we can also, obviously, listen to some music. Um, but I would like to make this sort of more secluded area. Not just sort of free and open to everybody. Um... That is an awesome formation up there. Very cool. But yeah, look at this. This little area right here, actually, when you look at it from this angle, is looking quite a bit better. Uh, I really like that a lot, actually. Looks That looks really nice. Uh, I might have to take a screenshot of that. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like below. And um, make sure you guys leave your best wishes as well for my mom and her surgery. And um, thank you so much for watching. And I will talk to you guys on uh, on Friday for TQF. Yes, TQF. So stay tuned for that. It's going to be a fun one. And if you have not left your questions yet for TQF, go back to last Friday's video, the TQF on there. Leave your questions for TQF, which if you don't know, it's triple triple question Friday, in which every Friday I answer three of the audience's questions um, about me. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So thank you guys so much. I'll talk to you later. Peace.